video. I literally look bald. Like, do I look cute or do I look bald? Because I feel like this is just doing nothing for my head. It's giving slick back. I look like my father. It is Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. You'll be seeing this on Wednesday. So, you guys along throughout the day. So, obviously, go to the gym. I go to the gym at 10 30 every single day. So that has been a really good like constant routine for me. So we're gonna go to the gym together. Um, I really wanna go to Target. That, what I have planned for my day is obviously to film with you guys, but I'm also cleaning the house. The house isn't super dirty, but I don't know why I feel like it's super dirty. So I'm gonna clean the house. Kinda go about the day, I'm cleaning the house. And I guess you're just gonna have to fucking watch and see what else I do because who knows what Jersey is gonna do. I actually have Jordan's game tonight as well. So maybe I won't be making dinner. And we'll go to Jordan's game tonight, and I don't know. We'll just see how the night takes us. It's 9.50, and I need to hurry up. I'm, like, low-key starting a little bit later because I had to strip the bed because I'm washing, like, our sheets and pillowcases right now. I've opened this Rosé Bubbles Organ Ground 11% alcohol. Let's open this bitch up, and we're just going to drink it. Like, we're just going to chug it. Ha! Gotcha, bitch! Mother-in-law actually brought these to me. She brought two of them when she came over, and she's like, I brought these for us to drink. I'm like... Oh lord, girl, they 11% alcohol. You want me to act up? Really made me and Anthony both boiled eggs, but clearly he's not eating them. I boiled egg and bacon yesterday, but since I started late, I don't have time to do all of that. So I'm gonna go ahead and like prep my boiled egg, get that ready, and probably do some like grapes and stuff. I really want something else to go on the side of this, so we're gonna have to try and make this egg good. It's so hard to get an egg, like to get it all off. Like it's so time consuming and I meant to do these yesterday but we had Coco Bear over yesterday because it was her birthday and literally it was so much fun. Like I love Coco being here. It makes me so happy when she's here. I'm go watch my TikTok because I literally, we sang her happy birthday. I made her a birthday cake and everything. It was so freaking cute. Honestly, I kind of just like took the day off yesterday. I feel like you guys, as much as like you haven't seen me on YouTube, if you follow all of my other social medias, then you know I've been putting in work. Like I'm constantly posting on TikTok. I've been putting in work on those platforms and I love YouTube, but like obviously I have to take an entire day to film like a YouTube video or something like that. So it's just a little bit time consuming. These are where my roots are, so I need to see stick with them. I'm not going to leave you guys hanging or anything. I've been working my ass off so I decided to take a day off yesterday is moral of the story and I haven't taken a day off in a while which I didn't really take a day off. I was still working but I wasn't like filming every little thing. I really film every little thing of my day because that's what my life is. It's literally filming my life. It's really good to kind of just like chill and relax and I just laid with Coco like I actually sat down and watched TV Anthony made dinner, so that was good. Anthony tried cooking chorizo, and bro, I didn't nobody tell me that chorizo gets fucking everywhere. Backsplash, it was all on the microwave, the countertops, the fucking cabinets. Literally, that shit was everywhere. Giving me an anxiety attack. I took like uh, spaghetti and stuff. I knew that was like gonna be the vibe, but I was also like, fuck. I'm gonna hurry though, you guys, because my workout is like 15 minutes away from my house. I have my egg. Put this bad boy open. I hope you guys like boiled eggs. I think they're yummy. Like I think if you put salt and pepper, like they're a good um, breakfast, like quick on the go. I really shouldn't, but I'm going to. Literally. We are in the baddie mobile. Hey, I'm gonna hurry up and eat. I genuinely have to force myself to eat these eggs. But she canceled on me. You guys, she just canceled on me. She never cancels on me. Ugh, but I want to go to the gym. Ooh, I've been drinking the Alani like energy drinks. They sent me the cherry slush and the peach one, but this is the kiwi guava. Shit is actually gas. Like the way that they do like their cans and stuff. I don't know what to do now. Like she canceled on me. I can use a day off, but like damn. I'm just going to run when Anthony gets home. Let's call him. Hey babe. Good morning. 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 Um, so I'm literally on my way right now to Angelica and canceled on me. Awesome. Not awesome. Now I'm not working out. I can still go, but like, bruh. We could, we could go on a run. I was gonna, yeah, that's why I was calling you. I was I gonna ask, are you gonna go on a run? Because if so, then I'll just, that will be my workout. Yeah, I gotta go get a haircut after work. Because I have that meat. Do you want to do tacos tonight? Like, eat out and get tacos? Since it's Taco Tuesday? Or do you want us, do you want to make food? That's cool. Alright, I love you, babe. I'll let you know I'm going golf on Saturday morning. That's fine. 
I don't forget and let you know like Friday night. Oh, you're fine. I know I'm fine, but. <laughs> okay, bye. Mom, so she's doing her job today, like substituting. Um, like just to do. You guys don't know. Mom is like literally my assistant. It's her job. She's my assistant. Like she literally helps me with everything. That's why she's just the best mother ever. That's why I'm going to Target because I want to make her like a little basket of like goodies. Be some stuff for teaching, but also some like self-care stuff because she's like redoing her entire room too. So I really want to do that for her. You know what girl money means? It literally means like, like I got to ask Anthony these questions. I bought a $35 skirt. I'm going to take it back and get a Target $35 gift card. So basically... They gave me $35 for free. The girls that get it, get it. The girls that don't, don't. She got a little thrown off. She never ever does that, you guys. So seriously, like, if you train with her, you'll know she never ever does that. It's really important, so it's okay. I'm seriously so happy with my body so far. This results have been it. My body percentage fat went down 3%. My muscle weight went up. The results are actually there. Like, they're actually showing, so I just love that. I want to know what the hardest thing has been living with like my significant other this isn't even bad at all it's more because since i work from home like i'm home all day right at work and when he gets home from work he's done with work like that's it boom he's done but for me like i'm still working because i don't stop working until i'm literally in bed i'm like editing on my phone we're cooking dinner and i'm recording it because this is good content it sucks when he gets home and i'm still working so i'm really trying to find a balance i've been on a good schedule of waking up at 8 30 and then like being out of the house obviously before 10 10 30 because i'll go to my workout i want us to be able to still like have our time together so like for example like since i know we're going to jordan's game tonight at 6 30 like i'll be done like anything that has to be done at home or like you know but literally like my phone is my life is because that's my work bringing any of like my cameras and stuff like that it's funny because when people see me on my phone and shit and i'm like i'm working like don't think i'm not working me liking this post on instagram is me working it's so cool that i tell you guys all of this stuff because you really get to see like what it is like I'm so grateful for the job that i live like i really am and also to you guys with talking about my job i don't know where this conversation is going two new tattoos that is literally because of my job <gasps> can i do it can i do it i feel like i can't do it never say you can't bitch so, if you have had the alani drinks before they give you guys headaches so happy when i saw that there's zero sugar in it but it has 200 milligrams of caffeine that's what's kind of me is like 200 milligrams of caffeine bro like that's a lot that's what gives me headaches but i just saw that they posted on their instagram that they came out with mini ones that have 100 milligrams of caffeine she sent a picture in the group chat like of it and if you guys didn't know my mom used to be a teacher i think i have a lot of her old students that watch me as well but the best teacher ever you guys three of us went to canyon breeze either her desk i would always say that my stomach hurt so i would just go to her and literally lay underneath her desk and like talk to everybody that was in there if my mom has taught you you know she is just the overall best teacher ever really actually cares for her students and i feel like her doing this like going and substituting is really helping her because it's something like she's gonna enjoy like more of like waking up and doing all of that and you guys know my mom has lupus so it's really hard like she never really knows like how her days are gonna go she doesn't work like a full-time job and stuff like that luckily like she doesn't have to work a full-time job yeah i think she's gonna love it we're here we are at target target when they've only been for 18 minutes what this must be what it's like like when you grow up like you go to target you know like this early in the fucking morning so i'm trying the new kiwi guava by alani they sent me this one okay what the hell jersey you've already tried it sometimes my words just keep, don't make sense i'm just <laughs> y'all are making me shy guava flavor from alani 10 out of 10 it is bomb it actually tastes like a kiwi tea <laughs> no fucking way honestly i think i'm just gonna bring you guys in I'm bring you guys in. Whatever. Fuck it. Let's go. You're turned, and if you pass the five dollar section in Target, you're tripping. Y'all literally don't sleep on Target's clothing. I feel like their fall clothing is coming back, even though I returned the skirt right now. But they're like, I feel like these are cute. It's colored, but like they have black ones. Like that's low key kind of cute. Black leather pants for thirty two dollars, and if they fit you, they're definitely not gonna fit me because I'm a short girl. But like if you're taller, this is where you should get your leather pants from. Okay, you guys, I feel like this is so cute. It's 25 bucks, but 
Like this would be a cute. She loves like jackets like this. So it says do more with what makes you smile, which I feel like is so her. I don't have her size. This one is so cute. Happy and bothered self-love club. Like, this is so her. Like don't sleep on them. Like look at this. Y'all, these are so freaking cute. Like Target is, it's over for them. They're literally like, I don't know. They're just on one. With the hard bottom, so freaking cute. Girlies, they have pink dupes. No way. No fucking way. What? 30 bucks. But I'm a kid size. These are even really cute. For the neutral girl. They literally look like Uggs. Look like freaking Uggs. For $20. Here's what the cart is looking like. I think I'm gonna get these for my mom because they're so cute. And the black ones, I don't know if I'm gonna get the brown, but I'm for sure gonna get the brown shook and I'm honestly on overwhelm. Just film so that I can make a TikTok out of all of it because I'm like, what the? I'm in the fitting room. I have four things to try on. Let's get undressed. Are you guys here? is one literally this is the same exact skirt that i returned but it's in a lighter color and it's like shorter than me so cute okay guys i feel like this is so cute if it was like less fabric almost too thick so i'm in the rug section and i feel like this rug is so cute we need a rug for like our dining area and I like that it has this like brown in it because our chairs all have like brown accents to them but black or white. It's so cute. Dude. Low key love it. You guys, it's so pretty. It's so cute. It's like very like fallish too. With these orchids, but mine always like doesn't die but it lasts like two weeks and then I have to buy a new one and they're like $15 at fries. So this is $15 and it's a fake one but like, I don't know, does it look too fake? I almost feel like it looks way too fake. Pretty to like have in the kitchen. All right, Chelsea, my mom literally like loves cotton candy, so I'm gonna get her probably just one of them. Cherry and the blue raspberry, because I feel like this would be so cute for her to like take, you know? Cherry one. The candy bowl, and I want to start putting like candy in it. And here for like two hours. Pens for her. She loves blue pens. Literally don't get her any other pen. actually calling me right now, so let's answer her. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Okay, where are you? Girl, where do you think I'm at? You're a target. <laughs> yeah. Should this rug fit? Oh, well, yeah, I messaged you back. Do I like that? It's cute. I know. She's a teacher. Honestly, spent way too much money. Woo! Really? 12, 10, y'all. I mean, they're at 10. Away. Yes. Uh, how old are they? Third grade, they're so cute. All right, you guys, I just got off of the phone with my mom. She had her little lunch break. She has no clue that like what I'm doing for her, so I'm really excited to like surprise her with it. But I'm gonna go ahead and run into Joe's Tacos. Um, I don't know, I wanna try it out, and it's Taco Tuesday, so hopefully they're like a dollar. I really wanna get something cheap. I just broke the bank account, and I'm low-key crying in the inside. I was sitting here for a second like, <gasps> oh, like I love spending money because I deserve to get things but I just like hate it at the same time because I've gone through a really dark path of like spending way too much money at one point so I just don't want to get back on that so like I beat myself up when I buy something or like you know but really like I myself like three things and the rest is all for my mom she loves it. Go ahead and go in and get some lunch. I'm not gonna take you guys in because it looks like there's a whole bunch of fucking workers in there. And I just, I have on a tight ass bodysuit. I'm gonna be stared at. So I just like don't want them to also stare at me even more because I have a camera. So I will see you guys when I get back. Done in there. Literally, it took forever, you guys. It's already about to be one o'clock. Like, what? They were cheap. It was $6.50. So uncomfortable because there was just so much damn men in there. So it was like. I wish I would have got like a horchata from there or something. So me and Anthony are gonna go back later tonight if these tacos are bomb. So we'll see if not spend two hours in Target. Flip these bad boys. Oh, uh, literally those Olani drinks, ugh, make me feel right. Let's pad up in that bitch. Done. Drinking Fanta soda because we have no Pepsi in the fridge. I'm so hungry that I just, I feel like I can't even think. I be joking, bro. The hair of my food, bro. So annoying, you guys.
so fucking hungry. I just, I just can't believe that though. Although Shalonga was definitely better. It's time to do my laundry. Please don't judge me. This is like my second time. A lot and I've been letting it like pile up and Anthony has been doing the same thing. We need to not do that anymore. Tonys, all of that and yeah. Right here's where I'm supposed to be. I don't care if the sky came falling down right now. Oh, my ass hurts, you guys. Can't forget about you guys. Detergent, buffener. I'm gonna find something like a good like wash that maybe you specifically use on chunks and stuff, you know? I'm like Anthony's laundry touching mine. Like, separate bags, but literally you just like undo it and it's in a little bag and it's two of them. Go ahead and edit these TikToks really quick and then I'll go outside and grab all the Target stuff and give you guys a haul of everything that I got and then like start putting together my mom's little basket thing because I think she gets done with work at like 2.30 and she'll probably come here right after. Edit these on my phone. I literally just use CapCut, you guys. If you wanna know how like I get all of like my TikTok editing done, it's literally on CapCut. Go ahead and go grab everything out of the car. Ooh, it's Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna give you guys a haul. Like, if you watched my last video, I gave you guys a haul, but I'm also gonna give my TikTok a haul as well. Little card dollars for these cute ass ones. They are the Uggs dupe, y'all. Guys, I feel like I'm gonna be wearing this all throughout fall, and I know once I wash it, it's gonna fit me even more cuter, but it's basically like a little twisted, like right here in the front, long sleeve, and it's like long, light denim color. I will be wearing this all throughout fall order on me and it like actually hooks my body I got her this super cute bag shower curtain candy orchid plant this freaking rug laundry still all together and start cleaning the house because anthony's gonna be home soon a lot going on up in here in the sink and i need to unload the dishwasher and put another load of laundry in the thing to do in the kitchen to get your kitchen clean is make sure you have no dishes in the sink Alright you guys, I cleaned off like the kitchen countertops and everything, literally scrubbed them hella good, the sink, all of that. So now I'm going to go ahead and vacuum the floor and mop the floor. So it's going to be loud, but let's get into it. And my camera is finally back on. It's 3 o'clock, so we got to get going because we're barely on the kitchen. I don't know if I should use anything else, but this is what I've been doing and it makes the floor smell good. Please. Please. in blood. One of the last episode before Brantley, the looks Go ahead and vacuum our entire living room off again. I put some more clean water in my sewing here and I finished vacuuming, so now I'm gonna go ahead and mop and the kitchen is dry and everything, so let's go. I would proclaim Joe Rick was found and I'm her, you know, or heard. Really quick. attempt to cover and listen up the to girl's my little body. Any Elise thing. Context. Can innocent? Well, you, you know. Why do investigators sit against me? <gasps> so cute! It's your first day of work. <laughs> to teach your bag? Yeah, I'm good. He's inside. Aww, you didn't do that. <laughs> but the bag is mine? Yeah, the bag's yours. Oh, it's, it's so cute. So uh -huh. cute. Put your like, water bottle on the side. <gasps> What a cute idea. See, you know you are. From my mom. It's he brought those for you. From where? You left them on my mom's and I got them for you. You did and you put them in my car? Mm -hmm. I thought I left them. That's why I didn't know that they were up there until now. Thanks, the bad bitch sunglasses. Mm -hmm. um, this is so not the right one. <laughs> <laughs> it's the image one that I'm supposed to have, not the yours. You bought hot. Yo, I need to wax my fucking mustache. Right. You said you could speak. What? You you talk when you're. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> Ended up cleaning the kitchen dining area. Literally got all that shit out of it. You get mocked it. How you don't want to pull a shorty scared? <laughs> she dusted your stupid ass. Wait, who dusted who? Shirt didn't even look though. Quick question. I got a question for y'all. How do y'all feel about boyfriends and strip clubs? Curious that you're bringing that up because you must really want to go to a strip club. No, my bro, if a homie's 21st birthday and we're going to Vegas with his family, with his family, and then probably probably my people. I don't know if he's 
I don't know. I told Jersey, I just told Jersey about his birthday. I didn't say nothing about no strip club. And she said, okay, don't go to a strip club. I said, okay, babe, I don't care if you go on a boys trip or do any of that. I right. don't mind so, that. But uh, the one thing that I don't fuck with is you go on a strip club. And, and it's so, as simple as that. And we're all going to the strip club. What do you want me to do? Stay back? And she said, yeah. Yeah. So how do y'all feel about that? Don't mess with strip clubs. I think if you want to go to a strip club when you're in a relationship, you're, you don't. It's not you, that I want to. They're going. It doesn't matter. Even if you're going with your friends, whatever, there's no reason why you need to be in a place like that when you have a girlfriend. We get in Chiba Hut. She's never had Chiba Hut. I've had Chiba Hut. Is Chiba Hut in Tucson, like across from the stadium? Yeah. Oh, then I've had you behind. I don't know what's wrong with you, girls. I feel like y'all don't need love. You need somebody who could micromanage you. Baby, I don't need nobody right to micromanage me, nor to tell me right from wrong. Which one I've been defending. In the video, you guys saw the question that I asked you guys that the girls that get it, get it. The girls that don't, don't. I to say I was going to Target, right? I took back something, and it was like $35. And I'm going to Target. Technically, they gave me like $35, right? So, like, that's a free $35. No. What do you mean, no? You check, you already bought it. So, $35 already. Yeah, but checked. like, in my girl mind, like, it's just extra money. No. <laughs> they already took $35 out of your account for that purchase. No. Yeah, they did. Well, the way I see it is that, that no, it's just a free $35 in that moment. Well, that's not I true. I got $35. That's not true at all. It's just a girl thing. Like, guys, that's not a girl it. thing. That's just a. No, that's not just like with, a That's girl not thing. smart with money thing. No. God damn. <laughs> I'm funny, dude, to see your reaction. Guys, you guys, I'm putting off before right now. We just got all showered. He made us fruit bowl. Tell him what show we're watching, babe. No addition story. This is. The new tat, the hands, you guys rising with Ash on Instagram did these for me. We went to a little Casa Lola pop up and here's what they look like. Create because I'm a creator, bitch. I create shit. Little stars, you guys, I really like these little hand tattoos. I think I'm definitely gonna get more on this hand. I am keeping completely free until me and Anthony get married and then we get his initial. Each other's initial when we get married? Mm-hmm. So cute though, it's so dainty, y'all. Guys, and I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And stay tuned for the next. Bye.